What's going on, everybody? It's the Blockchain Raccoon, keeping you updated with the latest cryptocurrency news and analysis. Hope you all had a fantastic weekend, because a lot of coins did, and Shibu Inu definitely saw some 45% gains over the weekend. Ooh, that just made my little raccoon hairs tingle. Kind of glad I got in on that puppy. But folks... I want to announce that MasterCard and BACT partner to offer innovative crypto and loyalty solutions. Today, MasterCard and BACT announced a multifaceted partnership to make it easier for merchants, banks, and fintechs in the U.S. to embrace and offer a broad set of cryptocurrency solutions and services. Consumers, in turn, will experience expanded access to the digital asset ecosystem. BACT extends MasterCard's ecosystem of cryptocurrency partners, enabling crypto as a service, which provides quick access to cryptocurrency capabilities. Through the power of the MasterCard network and BACT's trusted digital asset platform, MasterCard partners will be able to offer cryptocurrency solutions these include the ability for consumers to buy, sell, and hold digital assets through custodial wallets empowered by the BAT platform and streamline issuance of branded crypto debit and credit cards. MasterCard will also integrate crypto into its loyalty solutions, enabling its partners to offer cryptocurrency as rewards and create fungibility between loyalty points and other digital assets. This means that consumers can earn and spend rewards in cryptocurrency instead of traditional loyalty points and seamlessly convert their crypto holdings to pay for purchases. This is the latest move by MasterCard to bring innovative loyalty options to consumers that align with their passion points. Now, Sherry Heyman states that MasterCard is committed to offering a wide range of payment solutions that deliver more choice, value, and impact every day. Now, through their digital partnerships at MasterCard and BACT, and will be grounded by their principled approach to innovation, and they only want to empower their partners to offer a dynamic mix of digital asset options and deliver their differentiated and relevant consumer experiences, she quotes. Now, consumers continue to seek out crypto assets as an option for everyday purchases. And the BACT U.S. Consumer Crypto Survey 2,000 U.S. consumers, nearly about 48% of respondents reported purchasing crypto in the first half of 2021, while 32% of those who didn't are either very or somewhat interested in doing so before year's end. And according to the MasterCard New Payments Index, 77% of millennials stated that they are interested in learning more about cryptocurrency with 75% saying that they would use cryptocurrency if they understood it better. Now there's a quote here that we're incredibly excited to partner with MasterCard to bring crypto loyalty service to millions of consumers, said Nancy Gordon, EVP, Loyalty Rewards and Payments at that. As brands and merchants look to appeal to younger consumers and their transaction preferences, these news offerings New offerings represent a unique opportunity to satisfy increased demand for crypto payments and rewards flexibility. Now, the partnership builds upon both companies' commitment to the crypto ecosystem. BAT, publicly listed on the New York Stock Exchange under the ticker symbol BKKT on October 18, 2021, while MasterCard continues to invest in the digital asset space through several initiatives. These include the acquisition of CypherTrace, partnerships with leading crypto players, and the creation of new platforms to test and support central bank digital currencies and more. Well, folks, I'm going to wrap this little short little video up by stating the obvious. Um, I am not a financial advisor. Please do your own research and uh, invest responsibly. Thanks for tuning in.